How to choose a pair of headphones. Welcome to Video Jug. I'm Stuart Headland. Now, choosing a pair of headphones is very much down to personal preference, as only you know what feels comfortable. There are three kinds of headphones, but the only rule to remember is that you should try before you buy, and if the store won't let you do that, try and make sure they have a decent returns policy. The first kind of headphone is the bug design. These have good sound quality and sit either just outside or slightly inside the ear canal. The in-ear models also offer better bass reproduction and block out a certain amount of ambient noise. The more expensive the headphones you buy, the more noise they'll block out. In-ear headphones are subtle to use and easy to transport, but some people have said that they're uncomfortable to use for long periods of time. Some people also don't like the sense of isolation you get from the in-ear models. The second kind of headphone fit over your head and are called closed cup because of the way they seal around your ear. They're pretty good at blocking out external noise and are fairly effective at preventing anyone else from hearing what you're listening to. The downside is that they can struggle to effectively reproduce bass frequencies and their sealed nature can make your ears uncomfortably hot if you wear them for long periods of time. The third kind of headphone are open headphones. These sit on the ear and tend to let sound escape out the back, leading to that annoying chittering noise that people around you seem to find so irritating. They offer the most natural sound to the listener and tend to be the most comfortable to wear as they let more air flow around the ear and exert less pressure on the ear itself. New technologies to consider include noise cancelling headphones. These generate sound waves that block out ambient noise, however they tend to only be effective against consistent noises like the whine of an aircraft cabin or air conditioning. Wireless headphones are also becoming more common. While they have an obvious advantage in lacking cables, some models have had problems with both sound quality and signal strength. So there you go, there are the options, go choose your headphones. Done.